Dozens of classic cars have been gracing the streets of Linden already this season. If you haven't had a chance to see them yet, there's still plenty of time. Greg Jones of Sunset Coral is joining us in studio to talk about the summer car cruise. And first things first, I have to take a moment to say, ooh, <laughs> ah, I love anything that flashes. Look at that. Check that out. What are we looking at here? That's pretty snazzy, my friend. So this is our, this is our Cruiser of the Week trophy. So uh, each week I have a, a random person pick out a car that has some kind of meaning to them and present that to the, to the driver. I think that's a great idea. Well, tell us, you know, how the summer car cruise came about. Well, uh, oh, this is our fourth year doing it, and uh, I, own, I own a fish store here in Linden, and I bought a car, and I was never able to go to any other cruises. So I said, why not start my own? Bring, a, bring the cruise bring to here. you. I'm always there anyway, so yeah, so we started our own, and uh, it's been going strong ever since. And how long have you been doing it now? This will be the fourth year. And how's it going? It's doing great. It's really growing this year. Um, we had 47 cars show up last week. And uh, just uh, it's just a fun, fun group of people, and uh, we just we have, we really enjoy it. It's, it's I don't know, it's kind of my coffee night. Well, listen, I, I'm, I am a little jealous of the glowing award. I think that is so cool. What's the feedback on this? Uh, everyone seems to like it. I gave away the first one last last week, and uh, they seem to be pretty excited about it. So, and what's so cool? I mean, again, we live in car country, if you will, mm -hmm, yeah. and there's some real treasures in, in Michigan. Yeah. How is this a chance for people to to show off their babies? Well, it's just this is a um, it's a car cruise, so it's not a car show. So anybody can bring any kind of car they want. So it's not about having the best car out there. It's just about the experience. Yeah, and, variety. Oh, for sure. <laughs> and uh, well, yeah, we have, you wouldn't believe what we get sometimes. It's awesome. But uh, I guess the tractor counts too. Yeah. It yeah. rolls. I tell everybody if they enjoy it, then somebody else will too. That is so wonderful. <laughs> and, and talk about, um, you know, just how the communities embrace this. Yeah, so it's growing. We get a lot of, you know, we have some great sponsors in the community, the Ice Cream Garage, and um, we have uh, Auto Value, Auto Parts, and Fenton's get involved with it now. And they, uh, we get a lot of people just walking around uptown, just families coming, checking it out, listening to the music, and telling stories about, you know, their past when they had, you know, some of these certain cars. Well, and I'm sure you draw on some attention when you have, you know, again, dune buggies and tractors and right. a variety <laughs> of cars. Well, what's your ride, by the way? Uh, I have an 85 Trans Am. Nice. So, yeah, it's fun. Yeah, awesome. And then, uh, so how long does this go through the summer? So all the way through Halloween. So oh, wow. it's uh, every Thursday night um, now until now until Halloween, and then. Uh, it, it, I like your graphic there. Cruising uh, at the fish store. It says yeah. it all. Yeah. <laughs> nice combination there. And uh, again, great way to bring people to downtown. Yep. Support businesses like yours Absolutely. too. Absolutely. And then, if people are interested, do they just show up, or how does it work? Yeah. Yeah. There's no registration or anything. Um, I. When they, uh, if they bring a car, they'll get a, a ticket for a driver's ticket, and I always pick up a couple prizes each week to give out. And uh, then, of course, we have the cruiser of the week uh, that we do as well, too. So. Oh, wonder. oh, there we go. We'll end on the the flashing award. You see, it's even a fishbowl. I think that's so <laughs> creative. Uh, thanks so much, Greg, for coming in. And uh, I, honestly, Christina, I'm a little jealous of this. Like I said, this is kind of this is cool. I want this on my newsroom desk.